Welcome mates on Bloodthirsty Lord by Yunkui Lordy and today we're back on Paragon. We have some very interesting news to talk about and that is the new hero trailer just got released a couple of hours ago. I said yesterday 2, 4am waiting for this to come out, nothing came out and then it comes out a couple of hours ago once I wake up. So that's just like annoying, the worst feeling but it doesn't matter, we're going to push through and talk about this new hero Terra and look at the Winterfair skins that are in this trailer as well because they show so much in this trailer, it's insane. But before we get to this video, make sure you smash that blood like button and let's try to get 200 likes on this video. So without further ado, let's get straight into this. So pretty much we're going to watch the trailer and also talk about everything that does come up at that exact same moment. Most likely the trailer is going to be looping in the video, but I'll pretty much explain everything that I do see at that exact time when I'm watching it right now. So let's go through it and see what happens. Obviously, I've heard the music, and the music is amazing and reminds me of Vikings, and that's just such a cool vibe. So make sure to watch the trailer for yourself. Link to that in the description below. So we start off with the 7 Second Hero teaser, then it turns around towards Terra, then we get to see her face, full reveal, look at that, that is crazy. And then we go into the gameplay straight away, and this could be something crazy. So we see her slam her actual axe towards the ground, stunning all opponents around her, followed up by also doing this spinning attack with her axe. So she's got like this little bit Darius twist from League of Legends. She spins with an axe and does damage, so that's pretty nice. Followed up by, there was a Morgesh skin. A Winterfest Morgesh skin. Being able to see, she looked like she went to swarm mode and she went full ice. So that's crazy. A little graphic, a little change there for her ability, insane. And then it comes towards the next part of this ability. She looks like she has a deflect mechanic. Gideon shoots a projectile towards her, and then she's able to go to this like stance with her shield. And then she deflects it. But I don't know if it goes back towards the enemy or just deflects and goes somewhere else randomly and does no damage to anyone else and pretty much nullifies any damage coming towards her for that damage instance. Maybe that could be the, one of her abilities. I'm not too sure. Because right now, I don't know why there's no blog post talking about her abilities. Usually, new hero trailer, new blog post talking about abilities, her lore, everything. Nothing. Give this time. I don't know why. So it's really interesting. So we're just watching the video and talking about each ability as we see it. But right after that deflect mechanic, we do see Gideon enter his ultimate meaning. We get to see other characters around there. It looks like we saw... Let me go back a bit. Okay, we see Aurora in her Winterfest skin. Cool. We already know about her skin. But then we also see another character. And it seems to be Revenant. Revenant got a Winterfest skin as well. Oh my god, his head is on fire too. Like a blue lit flame. That is so cool. And then we see Terra, the new hero, just charge in with her armor down, aka her helmet down. And she goes in like this full armor state and she goes towards the Gideon's ultimate and does nothing towards him. She has a cleanse mechanic most likely. Because obviously Gideon's ultimate works like stun every damage instance. And obviously she, when she entered, she would have got stunned, but she didn't get stunned in this mode. So when she enters this mode, I'm guessing this is going to be her ultimate. She enters this mode, she doesn't take any damage at all. Because we already saw like three abilities. So that's really sick that this is going to be ultimate. Means she's the ultimate fighter. And she's making crowd control mean nothing towards her. We've wanted a hero. We've wanted a mechanic that reduced CC in any way possible. And they just chose to release a hero that does all that. So that's just crazy. And then we see Glacial Rampage. Followed by this Lieutenant Balka skin. I really don't know what it is. But it looks like she's like a stone version of herself. Then they go fight. And they have the little battle axe fight going on. It's pretty cool. Then we get another look at Terra. With her little emotes. Crazy counters out of nowhere. And they're just looking towards each other deeply and, you know, having that intimate session. And then bang, she goes for the fight and duel once again, like in the lore story. And there's also another skin available, something Night Terror. You'll be able to see it right now on your screen or throughout the trailer that was running in the background. Pretty cool. Then we got Winterfest, December 12th, my birthday, 2 January 8th. That is just amazing. And I can't wait for that event because we're going to have something special for that. Play and earn free skins. Yes, you can play the game. Earn free skins, now that EA trash mechanic stuff happening here, that's for sure. So it's really cool that you can do that and just get free skins. Because that's what it should be. You play the game, you enjoy the game, and then you get nasty skins to use for yourself. And this is when we get a full-on close-up towards the actual Aurora skin, Morgesh skin, and also the Revenant skin. This is going to be amazing. Obviously, in the background, there's a Winterfest map as well. So Christmas vibes on Monolith. We already know that was going to happen like last time. And it's really cool that it's happening full-on scale this time. So that's really happy about that. And mates, also, I'm going to be giving some free codes sometime soon. I'm going to try my best to get some free codes from Epic Games and the Paragon team to give you guys something back for this Winterfest 2017 event. Because obviously, you can open the chest or the skin and you're able to get something out of it. Pretty much, that's the idea. And hopefully you get the skins or you get something that's Christmas related. Because that would be so cool. I'm going to double check on that. And most likely if I do get anything, I'll make another video talking about that. Sorry if I do sound tired. It's obviously because I just woke up. But mates, as always, tell me your opinions and thoughts in the comment section down below. What do you think about this terror announcement trailer and also the Winterfest vibe map and also the skins? Do you like them? Do you hate them? 
tell me in the comment section down below. Discussions are greatly appreciated because that's why a comment section is there for. So pretty much you go use that comment section and do what you want. So leave your opinions and thoughts in the comment section down below. So if you did enjoy this video, show your support especially that button like button. Let's try to get 200 likes on this video. And if you want to see more power gaming content and gaming content in general on my channel, all you have to do is share with your friends and hit the subscribe button to become a mate today. And that is all for this video. Oh, time to go, but don't you worry. We'll be back very soon. Hang tight, boys, because you ain't seen nothing yet. In my head at this moment, I go back, edit this video, upload it, you guys enjoy it, I enjoy you guys enjoying it, and then I go to sleep. But in reality, there's going to be more news in another half an hour from now, so there's just going to be two videos today, and when I'm in super tired mode. Yeah, that's fun. <laughs>